I like to say something. I am very honored and privileged to be here supporting the West End Mamas. I am very excited about dancing in that tiny stage. <laughs> Lord help us. Uh, <laughs> and I'm really happy that um, finally I'm able to work with the West End Mamas. Really, it's very exciting and it's going to be a great show. Yeah. Hello, George. It's been a long time. And yes. this time is like you are the best mamas in the world. No, are we? No, we're just one of many mamas. So but we just live a slightly different lifestyle, I think. <laughs> so what do you think about your show tonight? What do you expect? Um, well, it's been a very busy month for the West End Mamas, and it's great to culminate that to finish that off today this is probably our last show for a while mamas need to take a break after this so you know it's really been we've been raring this is like one of the most exciting shows i think we've done so far um, especially because we get to do it for our fellow filipinos here in the uk um, and I also get to be joined by my sister Lisa and my niece Missy, who flew all the way from the Philippines to support us. So this is a very, this is an extra, extra special West End Mama show, and I'm really looking forward to it. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> <coughs> oh, Lisa. Yes. As a sister to your, to your mama sister, what can you say about her? I'm very, very proud of my sister, Gia. I think she's doing a great job. I think she's a hero because, you know, she's juggling so many things all at the same time. She's a great mom. She's a great wife. She's a great singer, actress, performer, organizer, manager, marketer. Uh, you know, name it, she's done it. And I salute her. I went through the same thing when Ballet Manila was starting. That was all 15 years ago when I had a lot more energy. <laughs> so I know that um, uh, Ballet, since Ballet Manila 15 years ago has taken off and has soared, I know that the Western Mamas also will take off and just soar. That's how the Makuhas do it. <laughs> Thank you. And back to you. Wow. What can you say about what your sister said? Oh, I, I didn't know she felt that way about me. I had a feeling she did, but you know, now I have it on camera. <laughs> yeah. What do you want to say to you? Yeah, all her support no. um, the thing is, I wouldn't have been this way if not for her shining example. And that's the truth, really. Um, every time I have a problem, every time issues come up, I know she's been there and done that. So she's like my first person to turn to, and she knows that. You know, she's only a phone call away, a text away, an email away, um, a Skype away. Um, you know, we've been both been through ups and downs in sort of slightly similar circumstances, but obviously she's got it on a bigger scale, organizing an entire ballet company and so many people, whereas I'm managing only three people. And it's hard work already. <laughs> so, <laughs> so um, what about yeah. your family? Uh, my family, um, they're just, they can't wait for mommy to come home and finish her last show, bless my children. are like, mommy, when are you going to get off the computer? When are you going to get off the phone? And you know, unfortunately, that comes with a job. So, um, you know, my husband's there. He's also grinning and bearing. But I think we're all looking forward to our little little bit of a break after today's show, but before this next, this show that's just about to come up, which will be a great show. Okay, Gia, <laughs> break the leg. Thank you.
Wait, wait, wait. Oh, uh. Because we're celebrating the Philippine independence. This is a post uh, celebration. The 114th. Uh, independence year. Yes, I know. I danced for. Uh, I have. I've done several Independence Day shows. This is the best show. <laughs> um, uh, okay, my message to all our kababayans, uh, whether you're in London or anywhere in the world, just be proud to be Filipino. Be true to yourself. Be true to your values. Your um, uh, love for country, uh, sense of duty, loyalty, um, and most especially, you know, hold your heads up high and say that you are Filipino uh, because it's the greatest uh, country to be from. I'm really proud to be Filipina um, and I'm proud to proclaim it to the whole world. I'd, I'd like to try. I don't think I can do that, but I'd like to try. <laughs> she will be. Huh? She will be. She will be. <laughs> so, of, any messages? To whom? To all the Filipinos in the UK? All the, Fili the world? all the Filipinos in the UK and around the world. Hmm. What I will say, what my mom said, be proud to be Filipino because, because it is the, one of the best nationalities you can uphold. And it doesn't matter what you look like. It doesn't matter if people judge you or whatever. Just be, <laughs> no, I'm not good with words. Be yourself. Be yourself. <laughs> and be proud to be Pinoy. Uh, yeah. <laughs> do your best in life. You don't look and too weird. I, I, I am. Exactly, exactly. But really, my dad told me I look Russian today, so... <laughs> I'm, from, I'm from all over the world, because... Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Missy. Oh. Yes, Missy. Oh, Missy. Yes. <laughs> oh, I need your light. Thank you, George. <laughs> oh, yeah, me too. Great. Yes, quite big, isn't it? Now it's been, it's very exciting. Um, well, actually, she said it was an honor to perform with us. Actually, it is our honor to be on stage, same stage with her. So it's, we're lucky. We you know, consider ourselves lucky, lucky for having her to perform with us. So, you know. Thank you very much. Thank so, you. Plans here? Um, well, officially starting tomorrow because the show is only is tonight is going to be over by tonight. Starting tomorrow, I shall be on a hundred percent holiday mode, uh, and uh, so I'm going to go completely out of shape. I am going to eat. <laughs> I am going to um, spend time with Gia and my niece and nephew and of course my family and we're going to do the sights, we're going to do a lot of shows and we're even going to go to Stonehenge so that I'm really excited because I've never been to Stonehenge and uh, we're going to do Windsor Castle I hope um, and watch even more shows. I really really am excited. It's going to be a very relaxing with the family. Yes, yes. And, and after London, we, our family goes off to Barcelona for uh, another week. And I've never been to Barcelona, so I'm really looking forward to it.
They don't really before the show. Rules. Oh. Well, before dance. It's alright. It's alright. Come. Oh, oh. Maya, come. Dali. Yeah. So. <laughs> <coughs> yes. It's been a while. I haven't seen you. Now you're doing a big show in London. Yes. So what? What do you make of it? Oh, what do I make of it? Hmm. What do I make of it? It's exciting, of course, because this is only the second time that we've done a show in London. The first time it was nerve-wracking because obviously we don't live in London and given that London has a lot of competition, competition there's a lot of us, a lot of performers who do what we do, obviously apart from what they do. Um, but of course our aim is for the Filipino people. It's to, what's the word? It's to show the Filipinos what we Filipinos can do, obviously for them to be proud. So um, it's exciting, so fingers crossed. So, we're just here. so how's the group now? Good, yeah. we're good, we're good. It's just that the mo while we're getting better, it seems like many things are happening on the family thing so it seems that we're getting challenged all the time which is a good thing because then it proves how dedicated we are how professional we are that despite all that the show goes on and we're getting better and better and better thank you thank you and good luck in the show thank you Great